Neil, had you had a vote, who would you have voted for for the MVP? And in the case of Iguodala, what I find interesting, and it's hard as a voter to do this, but the reason he gets open looks, the reason he has spacing on the floor, and he had good, don't get me wrong, he had some huge moments for that team when they needed it, but Steph Curry creates the space. So Correct. in some ways, if they're equal to me, the reason Iggy has stats is because of the space created by Curry. That's correct. So for me, the MVP of the finals was LeBron James, win or lose. I thought he had a tremendous finals all across the court. I mean, he was just dominating. And I think he looks even better once you take into account the quality of teammates that he had to play with. I mean, yeah. he literally carried them on his back. Now, as, as far as Iggy, you're absolutely right. I mean, they're double teaming Steph Curry. They're having someone on Klay Thompson like a blanket. So that's leaving a lot of different open looks. And if that doesn't happen, who knows what his stats look like. But, you know, the last two NBA finals of the winning team were both responsible for defending LeBron James, and they both won. I, I totally agree with you, Neil. And I, and I had a commentary the other day about how uh, it should be LeBron. This before the game. It should be LeBron whether he loses or wins. Right. And I went back and compared in my world of <laughs> covering NBA in, in another lifetime that I went back and the only other person that the only person that did win it as a losing player was was Jerry West. His numbers were a lot better. Jerry West had a triple double, but if you look back, LeBron had numbers across the board, new or old analytics that surpassed Jerry West. And Jerry West was playing against the Boston Celtics. And right. so I, right. that's that was the final proof for me. I wonder if you agree. Yeah, without a doubt. And when you look at the only two triple doubles in NBA Finals history with 40 points, the other one was Jerry West and, of course, LeBron James. I mean, we were talking about some performances which we haven't seen in quite a long time. And I understand that there's a propensity to have the MVP Finals, the Finals MVP from the winning team, but you still can't overlook how good LeBron James did. And actually, I'm quite surprised they even won two games out of the six because they just the supporting cast for LeBron just wasn't there I mean you know there was the injuries to Kyrie Irving the injuries to Kevin Love and the the Golden State Warriors knew what was coming I mean LeBron James is taking 44 percent of the possessions for himself he's accounting for I think 70 percent of every event that happened for the Cleveland Cavaliers but they still couldn't stop him so he had a tremendous final